Welcome everyone, I would like to show you how to split screen multitask on your iPad mini 6th generation. Keep in mind all applications will support split screen and I'll be showing you two methods in this video. Let's get started. So first of all, what I want you to do is open up the first application you want to split screen. And this is the first method. You see the triple lines at the very top. I want you to swipe down on the triple lines and you can either move Safari to the left of the home screen or the right. So let's move it to the right right here and you can see uh, Safari is right here. If you want to cancel the split screen, you just tap on the side and you can see, boom, we're brought back to Safari. However, let's say we want to do proper split screening. Well, all we need to do is open up the second application you want to split screen multitask. So let's choose notes. We just tap on notes and boom, you can see right here on the left, I have notes on the right. I have Safari. If let's open up Safari again. If you swipe down and you choose to the left hand side, that means when you split screen, Safari will be on the left. If you choose the right hand side, it will be on the right. So if we open up notes, now notes is on the right hand side. Well, if you want to resize these panels, well, that's very simple. You see this uh, line at the middle, just hold this and then drag. So we'll just go like this and you can see we can have 75%, 25%, 50%, 50% and 25% and 75% any more and you'll completely close out of the other application. Well, if you want to multitask more efficiently, well, you can put the apps you want to multitask inside of the dock and then you can just long press on the app you want, drag and then move it to the very site. Now, one thing to keep in mind is normal applications, again, will support split screen multitasking. However, there is another way to split screen with unsupported applications. So for the sake of this video, let's see, uh, say the notes application isn't supported. Well, what you can do is a pop out view. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get messages. I'm gonna long press and hold, and you just want to drag it, not to the very edge. However, you know, to the middle-ish of the notes app and just release and you can see the messages app is now in a floating view so you can move this to the left hand side and the right hand side as well and what you can do finally is you can have multiple of these applications available and you can easily switch between them so let's say i want to have multiple applications in this pop-out view let's say notes we'll just long uh we'll do notes let's do the photos app we'll long press hold and then just you know select our other messages and then we can see we have the photos app and then what you can do is you see this other a home bar you can swipe up and hold swipe up and hold and you can see you can switch between the application you want in this float out view if you want to remove the float out view uh, drag from the triple lines and you swipe to the right if you're on the right hand side or swipe to the left if you're on the left hand side if you want to bring back those applications just swipe back from the left and boom you can see those applications are now available so hopefully this video did help you out if it did make sure to smash like subscribe for brand new check out my playlist on the end screens right now for the ipad mini 6th generation tips and tricks i have a bunch of tips and tricks uh, which will help you out so i recommend you check out that playlist on the end screens right now if you don't see the end screens check the description down below see you guys later thanks for watching bye bye